Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 11 of the Adobe Illustrator tutorial series. So today we're going to uh, work out with pencil tool, blob brush tool and brush tool. So pencil tool is over located over here and you can see that the pencil tool is there. And if I were to zoom in and if I were to draw in, you can see that pencil tool actually helped me draw freely. So last time we actually um, played around with strokes a bit and you can see that the same stroke is being applied over here but I don't really want that so I'm gonna change that option so I'm gonna disable dash lines over here and just uh, draw it around and you can see that I have a normal stroke so if you're using a tablet then this is actually a great way to draw uh, your designs but since I'm not using a tablet then this is actually not very that um, not much that helpful so over here, so you can see that you can use pencil tool, you can increase the stroke size over here as well. So if I want to do my signature or something, then this is actually quite helpful. So you can see that this uh, adds in the points that connects the dots and then creates a shape that I simply scribble onto the screen. So that's what the pencil tool does. Um, let me just select other shapes over here. So you can see that this is quite useful. Well, over here, there's other tools over here as well. So there's the brush tool. So brush tool is actually much more smoother than the pencil tool. So I can increase the size of the stroke as well. You can see that the brush tool is much more smoother. So let me just create the basic shape over here. So you can see that the brush tool also does kind of a similar thing, but uh, does a much more smoother job. Uh, it smooths out the edges after it actually... Um, let me just change this out, okay, to basic you can see that this is much smoother than what i would draw with a pen tool so you can see that this is not really that smooth so but this actually smooths and smoothens out the shape so it kind of does a similar job if you ask me so not much difference over there and over here is the blob brush tool so right now what happens is that whenever i draw something out of the uh, brush tool what happens is that it actually creates a stroke so whenever i change the stroke what happens is that it changes the color of that stroke and because this is a stroke it draws the shape as a stroke when i use the brush tool or the pen tool pencil tool but when i use the blob brush tool what it does is i can increase the size of the blob brush tool by pressing the last bracket keys on my keyboard and whenever i draw you can see that it draws a line but and it smooths and uh, smoothens it out as well but it draws this as a shape so you can see that at the end uh, you can see a stroke so if i were to change the fill color then it actually changes the color but if i were to change the color of the stroke it actually ascends a stroke onto my blob brush tool so if i want to draw something like this something um uh, some designs then i can actually use my blob brush tool, brush tool over here so let's say i'm trying to draw an abc font and what i can do is simply draw this just like this and see what i can do now is i can uh, change the color and then add in stroke to this so that it actually has a unique design and i can also change the basics so that this actually acts as a shape as you can see over here so this is the this is how you use the pencil tool block brush tool and brush tool inside of adobe illustrator hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe 